commitments to fasting, I think the important thing to understand is if you have, first of all, if you have issues with food, there are other things. God knows the things that he wants you to detach from. Mm -hmm. You know, we all know those things that are, are, you know, make us feel guilty, don't make us feel as good as we should. So being able to detach from those things and focus on, you know, good habits as opposed to bad habits. So there are, there are challenges for fasting, like today I won't have any meat, I'll have one meal today, and I'll do that every Friday throughout Lent and Good Friday. But um, just challenging people to be better versions of them. I just think it gives me, uh, discipline has always been important for me in life. Once I started getting into movies and transitioned from music, I realized I needed a lot of discipline in my life, and that discipline has afforded me so many other things, and I've been rewarded for it so much, and I want to share that with people, so whether that's with fasting, working out more, detaching from other things, and just spending more time with God in prayer or in thoughtful reflection, and those things are important, so it's a balance. I don't want to jam it down anybody's throat, yeah. but I do not deny my faith. That's, that's an even bigger sin. You know, it's not popular in my uh, industry, but you know, I cannot deny my faith. It's important for me to share that with people, but I have friends from all walks of life, and it really has. It's, it's afforded me so many things. Obviously, you know, God didn't come to save the saints. He came to save the sinners. We've all had things and issues in our lives, and we want to be better versions of ourselves, and through focusing my faith, it's allowed me to do that, and I know people, a lot of people have been challenged with COVID and everything else. I mean, I was away from people and church and community and connection for a long time. But you know, with people are wearing masks and they want to, you know, stay away from each other, we want to bring people together. Came from not the uh, West Coast, but the Midwest. And so, you know, it really depends. I definitely have to get eight hours. Yeah. And you know, like winning the morning, getting up early, all of these things can be challenges that you can put for yourself. And those are, again, between you and God. So, you know, challenging yourself to get up a little earlier, have some reflection time. Thank you.